that kid was a complete thug. I'm telling you, I couldn't get out of there fast enough. Boy, Brian, you dodged a bullet not having to raise that kid. Your life would have been more miserable than a lonely old widow living in a downstairs apartment. Achoo! Quiet! Get out of there! What did I just say? I call the police! I don't know, Brian. Don't you think you have a responsibility to your son? Hey, Lois, I didn't even know I had a son until today. And, and besides, it's not like Tracy ever asked for my help. Yeah, it seemed like they're all set without you. She's done a fine job creating a child-friendly environment. Great parenting. I don't know, Brian. Raising a child is a very rewarding experience. You know what else is rewarding, Lois? Shutting your veg. What? What? Dylan! W what are you doing here? My mom wanted me to give you this. To Brian from Tracy. He's your problem now. P.S. Will you write me a letter of recommendation for the University of Phoenix? No. No, I'm not going to put myself on the line like that. But Dylan, oh my God! Everybody, this handsome, muscular boy is Brian's son, Dylan. Dylan is going to be staying with us for a while. Dylan, it's so nice to meet you. Shut up, bitch. Oh, he got you, Lois. That feels... That feels better. You sure that stuff is okay? All I know is the guys who made it are dead. Why is there no hole in this wall? You know, this thing is bugging me. All right, I'm gonna take a hike. And the Care Bear is just a Care Bear. I am so ready. Peter, what are you doing, crack? What the f Hey, at least I'm not drinking, Brian. Yeah, this isn't exactly a good substitute. Where'd you get crack? From Black's. What? Yeah, right behind Black's hardware store. There's a white guy selling it. Look, doing crack is not the way to stop drinking. Y you need to get to the heart of why you feel the need to drink in the first place. Look, here. This is the number of a hypnotherapist I want you to see. All right, Brian. Good. Hey, Peter, just thought I'd check on you. Oh, my God! Government came and took my baby! So, Meg, any luck finding another job? No. Hardly anybody's hiring right now. The only job I could find was for a phone sex line, and I sucked at it. What am I wearing? Um, a hat, a hat and glasses? What kind of underwear? Um, I don't know. Big underwear, I guess? I'm sorry, what? Oh, oh, what would I do, would to, you? I do to you? Well, um, um I, guess I guess maybe we'd, maybe get, pizza we'd get pizza and we could watch, we could watch house? house. All right, I am totally flaccid, but thank you anyway, ma'am. I appreciate your time. Hmm. Huh? What the? What the hell? How do you like it? Huh? How do you like it? You know what in God's name is this? Wait a minute. Are, are these pieces of Stewie's crib? I hate it here. Quagmire, you gotta help us. We pissed off a bunch of ghosts and now our house is gone and we got no place to stay. Uh, Peter, this is not the best time. Glenn, are you coming? Uh, yeah, honey, I'll be right there. Glenn! Glenn! I'll be right there. Uh, Peter, I'm really slammed right now. Can you give me the short version? Uh, what, uh, what's going on in here? Nothing. So, uh, as you can see, my family's here. And, uh, it's, it's game night. We're playing... Sex. Oh my god, I knew this day would come. Rupert, we're under attack by monsters! Dear god! Oh, but wait, there's Superman! He'll save us! Superman! Superman! Wait, 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 where are you going? What the hell with him? We'll have to deal with these marauders ourselves. Rupert, man your station! Alright, you undead bastards, time to send you back to hell! Hey, Stewie, you all set to go trick-or-treating? Whoa, what the hell are you doing? We're under attack, Brian! By zombies and vampires and a Mexican princess! Stewie, those aren't monsters. They're kids. They're trick-or-treaters. Trick-or-treaters? Yeah, it's what kids do on Halloween. They, they dress up in costumes and they go around asking for candy. How do you not know about trick-or-treating? Well, how do you not know that your reflection in the patio door isn't another dog? Hey, that guy's a dick. Hey, get out of here! This is my house! God, Brian, what happened? Who did this to you? Did you do this, you son of a bitch? 
Lois, you should just, you should just let those wounds get, get infected. infected. It'll, It'll teach him a lesson, lesson about being tough. Peter, he's just a baby. You gotta let this go. My baby boy got beat up by a girl. What was weird was that she was crying, but the way she was standing over me made it look like I was crying, which was weird. Peter, what exactly are you worried is gonna happen because of this? World War Five. Peter, we've been over this. There has to be a World War Three and Four first. Oh no, oh no, that's the beauty of World War Five, Lois. It's so intense, it skips over the other two. Peter, it doesn't work. I have spoken! I'm up here. Up here. If you want some, come and get some. 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 Yeah.